Hey, hey everybody, Nikki here with Black Dog Vintage and Antiques, and we're just stopping to pick up some cash at the ATM, because today we're headed to Brentfield, and we might meet some interesting people. So this is what parking looks like at Brimfield. Oh, see, I guess if you park back there, it's not as far, huh? Because here it is right here. So there it is. Let's see if we can find who we're supposed to meet. Burn barrel where she belongs. Over there on the left. All of that is part of Brimfield. We've just parked the RV. Boop. Getting the dog her medicine. Getting ready to her poor foot. We're gonna see if she's gonna ride in the cart, which we brought for our vintage hauls. But since we're kind of parked okay, we can walk stuff back if need be, I guess. <laughs> Yes, that was a big deal. That's Where's a great Ed? idea. Yeah. Oh, there's another brush. He has this guy. If I get thirsty, I'll just come back. Where's Ed? Where's Ed? I gotta find him. If you had beer, you'd be making a lot more money on your thing. But on this deal, you can get it. These guys are great. Look at these guys. They're adorable. I love them. Check out the cool Halloween. Oh my god, that's fabulous. Geranium. Oh, that's a huge flower frog. Look at this, bigger than my hands. Oh, chalet glass. So, do you have a favorite? Let me know, because they're all kind of gorgeous. Ooh, look at the owls. Oh, black cat with some rhinestones.
That's a big hand. Uh, oh, those are pretty. Oh, wow. You know I like my old stuff, guys. You know. Oh. That's different. That's super different. Bud man. I'm gonna enjoy one of you tonight. Oh my goodness. Oh, she's fabulous. And she's just screaming. Don't need to make me a zombie. I already am. Oh my goodness, is this howdy duty? Those are the ones that always freaked me out. These guys with their little mouths. So look at digging through the brooches. I got a cat brooch here and an Aurora Borealis and a very pretty pink enamel guy. And John wants a stuffed squirrel. Oh my gosh. They are great. Oh, there's no way you don't. Oh, you know where? If you ever get to Pennsylvania, we'll have to take you. Is there? Because that's where they have their stuff, right? In that Mantiques joint? Oh my gosh. The owl macrame. And it keeps going. Oh my god. Come on, y'all. You know I had to pick it up, right? At least he has a pot to you know what in. <laughs> He's great. He's cast iron. And he is fabulous. Look what I found, Jen. I slid into a little Victorian milk glass heaven. Now I have this at home, but I don't have the top. They're fabulous. Ooh, wait, this one kind of underneath here matches. Powder dish I have in there. Yeah. All right, it is. I've been looking for one of these. It's a knife holder, depression glass kitchen wares. So you put your butter knife on top of that. That's super cool. All right, let me know what it is. <laughs> It's a one-eyed weenus. That's what I'm going to call it. The fawn says, hey. Sporty Smurf. If you need to make a trunk coal, you can use these. Ooh, minis. Unopened. Yeah, isn't that neat? Look at the Santas. 80 degrees outside and I'm <laughs> Now I'm afraid. <gasps> no, why are they not alive? Oh, Marilyn. Oh my goodness, Lucille Ball. This is some magazine heaven. This won't have Burton's baby. Oh, these are the best, these ones here. I love these.
modern tone. Absolutely. Two pieces? Yes. This one's riding a snail, and this one's riding a frog. Oh my gosh, they're adorable! They sold today, yeah. Well, of course she sold and them she today. Had, she had the butterfly, and she... That's beautiful! Oh wow, it's the whole thing. That's cool. Cambridge glass. Lucky shines. Check out these little mini flasks. They're so cute. I check out all the Vaseline glass. This is gorgeous. Look at all this, guys. Oh, she's funky and awesome. I think it's the wolf dressed up as grandma. That's what I'm going with. Crystal oh. glass. Now that is an original milk glass Victorian dude. Just because nobody's ever, I'm never going to find this again. So ready? There we go. Watermelon glass. Oh. Never going to find it again. Ooh, I love the fish dish. That's fun. I think they're gorgeous. Yeah, I do too. I've never seen the black crest. This is pink and black. I've never seen that before. They're just... This purple yeah. thing. And this, this is its twinner. Oh, wow. Now, wait, we're going to get this, the peacock. Hi. Hi. These are fabulous. Oh, yeah. Wow, look at the size. Oh. And the Brooklyn Bridge. I'm feeling a little melty. A little melty. Not a lot. I'm actually really enjoying this. What I'm afraid of is I'm going to end up with sunburn later. So I'm slowly making my way back to the RV where John and Nick's are. Uh, Roy has said goodbye, his goodbyes. And uh, I'm just seeing if I missed any last minute deals. Those are ridiculous. Those are so cute. Uh, Jim, we got on the wagon. 50 bucks. Is gorgeous Benton look how pretty that is and how fancy would it be to drink wine out of those babies which is water with a slice of lemon that would work too oh, dragonware pocket face fabulous here kitty 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 if you give a mouse a cookie he turns into porcelain I am. Day's done. 
I'm back at the RV. I've had my wine slushy. That was hours ago. I'm now currently looking forward to a couple of ice cold beers back at the campsite, digging through everything I found, maybe even making a quick little video so you can see everything I found at Brimfield. Let me tell you, if you're willing to dig and you're willing to go boot the booth and be very judicious, you can find some really killer deals at Brimfield. And you can find some things you're never ever gonna see again. So until next time, stay swanky and stay classy.